KTSM 9 News reporter Shelby Cap was there earlier today and spoke to the county judge about how the first first come first served vaccination event went. Hundreds of cars could be seen lining up and then pulling into this a fire station here to get vaccinated. Some of them waiting hours, but tell me it's worth it. You know what? It was worth the wait. I, I really wanted the uh, Johnson and Johnson vaccination. Montana Vista resident Deborah Flowers waited three hours for the shot. El Paso County judge says the 1,400 people who got vaccinated won't wait again as the Johnson and Johnson vaccine is only one dose. You double that because they don't have to come back. Prior to noon, only Montana Vista residents residents could get vaccinated in an effort to reach the more vulnerable in the community. After that, it was open to anyone. We try to get every resident in here, but people cut in and, you know, they try to come in. And so we had to move them back to the back of the line. Uh, we've had Ubers coming in uh, to, <laughs> to deliver people, and we've had people from New York say they flew in. El Pasoan Isaac Vielma ended up waiting a total of six hours to get the vaccine after arriving before the clinic was open to the entire community. Got it. Understand it. Not a problem, but it's kind of frustrating when you come early in the morning and you don't learn till then and you took some time off. Now you might be wondering where these vaccines came from. They are not from the same supply that the city and county have been using. According to Judge Samaniego, the county registered with the federal government to receive these vaccines. The better we do it, the more we're going to get. And so this is another model to show the Biden administration. You give us, we'll do it. We know how to do this. The county judge tells me minus a few logistical glitches, he thinks overall the first come first serve a clinic did go well and that if the county is given a lot of vaccines to administer quickly again, they will have this type of clinic. Reporting in Far East El Paso, Shelby Cap, KTSM.